Greetings, everyone. I'm Dave Warren, the director of Forerunners of America, and I am so grateful that day and night has put forth this challenge to be part of the great experiment, these 10 days from June 1st to June 10th, because I'm partway through it right now, and it has been so good for me. I've needed this. I needed a push. I needed somebody to come along and say, hey, let's fast, let's pray, let's seek after God in a special way and believe him. So anyway, so grateful. It's been so good for me. Now, today, I want to challenge us to pray the Lord's Prayer, but only really one part of it. And that is, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. And the reason I'm saying this is because God, he wants to come and enforce his kingdom among us. According to Colossians 1, 13 through 14, we're already in God's kingdom as believers. So the kingdom's already here. But, God wants to enforce his kingdom. He wants to expand his kingdom. He wants to do something through us every day, and I'm especially focusing on today, that he wants to come and do something. So when we pray this, what's actually happening when we say, thy kingdom come? Well, he's coming in a greater sense of his presence. He's coming with his holy presence. He's coming in his power. 1 Corinthians 4.20 says, that the kingdom is not about words, but about power. So he's coming in his powerful presence. He's also coming in his glory. And we just want to keep praying this for all this to come, as well as he comes with his holy angels actually right into our homes, into our workplaces, wherever we are. He is enforcing his kingdom. And so today, as we go throughout the day, let's be praying this, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Now, before I close, I want to share one practical example, just because it's made such a huge difference in my life. And that is like, for example, I could be home alone and I just feel like some darkness or I feel some negative thoughts. I feel just a sense of, of, of everything is challenging. Well, I will speak this out. I will say, I belong to the Lord Jesus Christ into his kingdom, and I stand against every other kingdom. That's the whole prayer. I don't belabor it. But when I say that, and again, saying it out loud is key, when I say that, I can actually many times feel the atmosphere change within the room. What I, what I might say within my house, my whole house, that I'm believing God to enforce his kingdom. This is real stuff. This is what God, through Jesus, told us to pray. This is what we can do to see a difference. And I encourage you in that today. I look forward to being with you uh, for one more video.